Well, the theft takes an unnerving turn when a person is caught on camera swiping a basketball goal. Yeah, an alert 11 year old caught the alleged misdeed all on his cell phone. News 8's Julian Grace is live in studio tonight. Julian, this happened in broad daylight, too. Yeah, broad daylight. You can't believe that. In <laughs> Indiana, on top of that. Well, here's some more information for you. It happened shortly after the kids got home from school. And tonight, the parents and their kids, they tell me they just want their basketball, basketball, that is, go back. This is Indiana, and in just about every other yard is a hoop. Is it fair to say this is a basketball family? Uh, yeah, for the most part. We've gone to a few of our Pacer games. We definitely still love our Colts. Um, but yeah, we, basketball's definitely up there for us. But something happened to the wagers court, and the kids saw it all through the blinds. They say someone swiped their goal, and the oldest child caught it on his cell phone. These are some of the pictures of the man they say picked up the goal and placed it in the bed of his truck. It's, it's, it makes me sad um, to think that somebody is in the position that they feel like they needed to do that for whatever reason. One, they wanted it for their kids and just couldn't afford it, would rather steal it. Or two, they're going to go scrap it or sell it because they need the money. And mom says it was clear that it wasn't trash or that it wasn't being left out for scraps. One, it wasn't trash day. Two, it was upright, weighted down at the end of our driveway where it's been at since we bought it, where we play at it. You know, we play on it all the time. The neighbors come down and play on it. They, they were actually just playing on it over the weekend. The neighbors were. And now the birthday gift for the birthday boy is gone. When we asked him what he wanted for his birthday, that was basically the only response we got is that he wanted something like a basketball goal that he could go outside and have fun with and do it, do something active with. Um, and so we made that happen for him. That's what we got for him. And we are told that the wagers did reach out to the police department. However, they are still waiting for an officer to come out and pick up those pictures that you saw there. Now, once again, the family stressed to me, they just want their goal back. If it's brought back, no questions asked, just bring it on back. Mike?